showing you how to use a tub transfer bench in the bathroom. This is especially helpful if somebody's had a hip replacement or is weak and can't actually lift their leg up over top of the bench or over top of the edge of the tub. You know, even with grab bars, sometimes that's kind of an unsafe position to be in. So I have my friend Pat here, and she's never actually done this before. And that's part of the reason I wanted her to do it, to show you how I can just talk you right through it, and it's not that complicated of a thing. First of all, let me show you um, how this bench is. All four of the legs are adjustable. They have little uh, snap buttons here, so you can make it as high or as low as you want. This tub happens to be a little higher than the floor, so we had to adjust it. You want to, first of all, make sure that everything's locked in so that it's safe. And there are a lot of different styles of this. You can find these at Bed Bath & Beyond, Home Depot, I think Walmart might even be carrying them now. Um, of course, you could look online. They're just called a tub transfer bench. I think it's a lot cheaper if you go to a place like that rather than going to um, like a medical supply place. Okay, Pat, are we ready? Yes. <laughs> okay, go ahead and stand up for me. And we're having Pat use a, a walker, which she does not really use, so she really doesn't even know what she's doing today. Um, Pat, I want you to kind of back up and keep the walker with you. It's always very oh, important to okay. keep the walker with you. And I want you to back up all the way until you feel the tub bench behind your knees. And bring the walker right oh, along with I you. Can. There you go. And can you feel it back behind yes. your knees? Okay, yes. what I would like you to do is I'd like you to kind of reach back as you're sitting down so that you're, you're not just sitting and not yeah. sure of where you're going. There is a, a backrest there, so see if you can feel that right behind you. Oh, yes. And, and go ahead and, and have a seat. There you go. And I'm just going to get this out of your way. And before you do anything at all with your feet, I want you just to kind of wiggle yourself back okay. so that you're as far on the bench as you possibly can be. Okay. Okay, now at this point, let's go ahead and turn that direction. And while you're doing that, you can go ahead and lift that right leg over the edge of the tub. And now you can kind of start to scoot over that way while you're bringing the other leg okay. in. Mm -hmm. And go ahead and get get all the way over there, that's yeah. great. Now, yeah. one of the things that we like to do with the shower curtain here, because obviously you're going to get water yeah. on the floor if you're using the yeah. shower like this, so what we generally do is we cut some slits in the shower, and that way in the shower curtain, and we can just kind of tuck this in and tuck this in like this. You, you can see how that's going to go. So that's what we do with the shower curtain. Okay, now one of the things you want to do before you stand up and try to get out is you want to you want to dry your feet off, maybe throw a towel down in the bottom of the tub so, so you're working on a dry surface because we certainly don't want you to fall and break your hip again or, you know, whatever it was that caused you to be in this condition and make sure that, that things are all nice and dry out here. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to first of all kind of wiggle over to this end, lift that leg over. Good. It's the and traction on the bottom. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and go ahead and kind of turn and lift that leg over. And sure, right it out to the edge. And here's your walker. And you can come on back and sit over, over Great. here. Great. Good job. Now, sometimes people will have a lot of weakness so that they can't, they just literally cannot lift one of their legs up over the edge. And what you can do for that is there's a thing called a leg lifter, very appropriately named. And so they would do the same thing, they would wiggle back as far as they can, and then this is kind of semi-rigid here, and that will help them to lift that leg over right into the tub. And then of course, you know, get over here and get, get comfy again. Um, there is another kind of a bench available if you don't really need this elaborative one what you can do is just get a shower bench now when you use this 
you will need to have the strength and the ability to lift both both legs over while, while you're standing. This is a really good time to have a grab bar and you can just totally step over and sit on the on the bench like this.